NASA expected to announce tomorrow how and when it'll bring back two astronauts stuck at the International Space Station. Agency leaders will meet in Houston to decide whether Boeing's new Starliner capsule is safe enough to bring the astronauts home. Investigative reporter Cheryl Mercedes will be at Johnson Space Center for that announcement. And Cheryl, those astronauts were supposed to be at the ISS for eight days. They've now been there more than two months. Yeah, much longer, Len. Butch Wilmore and Cindy Williams launched from Cape Canaveral, Florida aboard the Boeing Starliner on June 5th. The plan was to spend just over a week in orbit and return to the U.S. on June 14th. But NASA scrapped those plans after thruster failures and helium leaks. A pair of astronauts have been parked at the ISS while engineers debate how to safely bring them back. One option NASA is considering would be to have a SpaceX capsule ferry them back, but that would keep the astronauts there until February. Astronaut Butch Wilmore's family says they're keeping everything in perspective. I know my dad and I know that he is happy to be up there for the most part. He loves being up on the station. He loves being with us because we are very close and he is missing out on a few things, but he knows it's in God's plan and he's up there doing some great work. We know the Lord's in control of it. He'll come back, you know, when the Lord sees fit. Engineers have been evaluating a new computer model for the Starliner thrusters and how they might perform as the capsule descends out of orbit and back to the U.S. NASA says its review of tomorrow will include a mission status update technical data and flight rationale to undock and return from the ISS. The agency is set to hold a news conference after those team leaders meet, and I will be there to bring you the latest. Mia, Len. Yeah, we are all waiting to see exactly what they're going to say. It's been a long time coming. Thank you, Cheryl.